Okay, welcome back to more Pokemon Shield. I was trying to explode the Dorbjo and this happened. Hoo hoo hoo, perfect. Now it's sure to work. All that's left is to fire it up with the on button. So here we go. Let's push it. Crrr. Cripes. It powered down. Must still need more watts. What is this thing? Some sort of machine made out of junk parts to look like a Pokemon. You like it? Yes. I thought you might be the type. That's my chromatic. And just to be clear, it's the invention of the century. It's my very own brilliant take on recycling. Though it doesn't do a thing right now, since it's out of power. If I just had enough watts. But mommy won't give me any more of hers. Can I give you mine? Also, is that a... Ah, so it is a key. Nice. All it would take is a measly 500 watts to get the Kramomatic up and running, you know? Oh, well, that's easy. It'll give me the 500 watts I need. It'd take me ages outdoors to collect 500 watts. And the outdoors and me, well, let's just say our systems aren't compatible. But you, sorry, what was your name again, Sato? I guess you're more of the outdoors type, huh? I'll feed those watts you gave me into the chromatic at once, and power on. Cry, cry them. <laughs> perfect, just perfect. Put in four items you don't need, and you'll get one new item in exchange. If you put in four of the apricot corns that grow here in the Isle of Armor, then you might even get a rare Pokemon, if you're real lucky. Since you gave me the bots and all, feel free to use my Cramomatic as much as you like. So I need four apricorns just to get a... I guess the coins go here. Ah, pink apricorns. Guess that makes sense. Can I just put in fossils? Let's see what happens if I put in fossils. <laughs> I got a shell bell. Hmm. Do I have to battle her? You seem to have an awesome bike. Let me customize it for you. Oh, I don't have to battle her. Nice. Um, but bike lady, customize your bike with a design that I came up with. Sure, why not? Uh, glistening black sounds cool. I'm guessing we get more customizations later. Oh cool, it changes our outfit too.
There's a boofalant. What the heck is that? Oh, that's a Dunsparce. Honestly, wasn't expecting them to have done the parts to the game. And I guess they do need a few bad Pokemon in the game, too. Uh, I don't actually know the middle one. Wait, that's Fletchender? I know the baby one's Fletchling. I thought Fletchlinger was the final evolution. Sure, I wouldn't be allowed to catch it, but I don't want to catch it anyways. Avery's dodo jacket. Tier seventy seven grass knot. Hmm. Green apple corn. Another green apple corn. Should be good to check it one more time. Another green apple corn. Oops. Quit. 
So I guess the different colored app coins go in for the different sections. Why is this one running so much further than the other one? Hey, get back here. Guess I'll stand right here. I'll change Pokemon this time.
No, it's not a welcome back. You were able to reclaim my uniform all by yourself? All? All by yourself? My uniform all. Hmm. I don't get it. Here you go. You have my thanks. Well, mustard Sato, you cleared the first trial like it was nothing. Why, I think this is the first time since Leon that someone was able to handle all three fast slowpoke on their own. The rest of you tried very hard too. You were able to catch up to the slowpoke, but I guess you couldn't defeat them. Tell you what, anyone who was able to catch up to the to a slowpoke at least once gets a pass. Sato really outdid himself, so it's only fair everyone else gets another chance. Trying to make a comeback, everybody? How generous. Either way, I'm still out. Oh, that reminds me, honey. Where are those little ones? Oh, that's right, darling. I had er nearly forgotten. Score Bulbasaur. Come on in. These are our sweet little Pokemon, Bulbasaur and Squirtle. We've all been taking care of them together, and I'd say they're more than a little curious about your strength as a trainer. Why don't you pick one to keep for yourself? You did succeed in the trial after all? And just so you know, these two have been raised in a very special way. When they evolve, they'll be able to Gigantamax. So you're going to go with our little Squirtle. It's great with water type moves. Sure, why not? the box for now. Squirtle looks pleased as a punch to that you chose it. Remember that your new Pokemon will be able to Gigantamax once it has fully evolved, so be sure to raise it well. Dynamaxing, a mysterious phenomenon no unique to the Pokemon of Claw. And then there's Gigantamaxine, a very special way of Dynamaxine for a very special Pokemon. Their moves change, of course, but their appearances change too. Speaking of Gigantamax, there's that secret recipe of the Master Dojo. Drinking it makes you gigantic and strong. It, I call it Max Soup. I'd love to have a bowl of max soup for, full of max mushrooms right about now. It sure has been a while. And that's why your second trial shall be mushroom picking. Max mushrooms are the key to Gigantamaxine, and I'm tasking you with finding three. Max mushrooms are red with a spiral pattern. I'm pretty sure they grow in dark, humid places. And with that, your next trial begins. I'm counting on you. And don't you worry, Bulbasaur. I'll be sure to raise you with lots of love. I'll make you s oh so strong, so you'll never lose to Squirtle. <laughs> Miss Honey, 
If you want that Pokemon to learn new moves, you can leave that to me. Well, aren't you just the sweetest thing? That lovely lad is always so kind. Give him a bit of M right or and he'll teach your darling new Pokemon a new move. You should give it a try. I mean, I'll talk to him. I'm completely obsessed with moves. Under the supervision of my master, I have been developing new Pokemon moves day and night. I've spent a lot of time developing many moves. I'll teach your Pokemon a move for a small token of gratitude. Shall I teach your Pokemon a move for five pieces of Amorite ore? Sure, why not? I just wanted to see Burning Jealousy. Interesting. Rising Voltage. Coaching. Scorching Sands. The user throws Scorching Sand at the target to attack. This may also leave the target with a burn. Neat. It's gonna change Pokemon. Cause I might as well. Hey, Sato. My bad, my bad. It just dawned on me that you're brand new to the Isle of Armor. I bet you have an idea where to... You have no idea where to even begin looking for Max Mushroom. Come on, let's go for a walk. I'll show you some Mushroom hotspots. Dum dum dee dee. Now, usually the forest of focus is chock full of box mushrooms, but the thing is, a swarm greedent came through and ate every last one here. So I'm thinking maybe you'll have more luck finding max mushrooms if we go check. Finding max mushrooms if you go check. Warm up tunnel. It's out on the other side of the forest. Just watch where you're going in the forest, okay? It's easy to get lost. Anywho, good luck with the hunt for Max Mushrooms. Catch you back at the dojo.
Moon guess A lot. Squirtle's evolving into War Turtle. People call me Digging Ma. Have you met Digging Pa? He's my partner. I enjoy digging and the thrill of digging with my lovely shovel. It's my digging friend. I feel like giving you a piece of him right or to commemorate our meeting. But no, I'll give you a chance to choose. You could choose the piece of ammo or, or you could use it as payment to have me dig to see if I can find even more amory ore. However, if my lovely shovel breaks while I'm digging, you won't get anything. I do need to ask you to quickly save your progress first, but if you are seeking some thrills, why not try your luck with me? Sure, why not? Digging always comes with risks. It's unavoidable. Brace yourself. Here we go. <laughs> oh, she moves? Huh. Okay, man. Rogunk. Oh, I have a Krogunk. Whoops. Angelo. How oh, dare it break free.
How many are in the forest? There are only seven in the forest? Hmm. What was that? Oh, the baby version of the Among Us. What kind of apricorns are here? Red ones. Emulga. How do I whistle? What? Ah, that's how I whistle. Was there Magnemite in the main game? I don't remember. Apparently not. Psyduck knows Cloud9. Hmm. Alright, that's the ability. Good dinner. That one? That's just karma, right? Oh. 
Courageous Cavern. That's six more in the Courageous Cavern. Wishmer or er, wish cash. Wishmer is the lower half portion. Apparently I have a wish cash. Well, it's gonna die. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that was a low kick. I, f I thought it was double kick for some reason. Alright, dusk balls. This is not the cave they wanted me to go to. Oh wait, up here.
punch her in. Actually, Chansey, no, dang it. There was one more in there, yeah, but I'm supposed to get mushrooms. Evolving. Cannon flame. Yeah, bro. Confused. I think I went to the wrong. Cave? Because I found no mushrooms in there. There's different amounts in different areas.
Do I have a Tornado? I don't know. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was from Patch of Grass. Yeah, I know. Apparently I don't. Fine, I'll catch one later. We don't get too many trainers out in these parts. They call me Diggin' Pa. You've met the Diggin' Duo. Well, they'd be my sons. Haven't got any armor right? Or have you? You know, it's that rare type of rock the Isle of Armor is known for. If you just give us a few pieces of that ore, I'll put these fine old muscles straight to work. Digging you up loads of watts. You know what? Our meeting feels like a real stroke of luck. If you like, I'll dig you up some watts for free to mark the occasion. You'll need to jot down your pr progress first. That's alright. Sure. Sure. Is he gonna stop? Okay, there we go. 19,000 watts just from digging. So this must have been the cave. Save and split the part here. See you next time.